हेलो गाइस वेलकम एंड वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल जेबीआर ऑनलाइन क्लासेस लाइक शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल हेलो एवरीवन सो इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू स्टार्ट एक्सरसाइज 11.5 फॉर द प्रीवियस वन प्लीज चेक द डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स द लिंक विल बी देयर सो हियर सम नंबर 1 वर्क आउट द फॉलोइंग डिवीजन सो फर्स्ट वन हियर 35x 28 डिवाइडेड बाय 5x 4 so here you can write down in a fraction form that means 35x plus 28 divided by 5x plus 4 now from the upper one if 7 will be common so here 5x plus 4 here in denominator also 5x plus 4 so this one this one cancel out your answer is 7 now number 2 in number 2 7 p square q square then multiply with 9 r minus 27 divided by you can write down directly in the denominator 63 pq and then here r minus 3 okay 63 pq r minus 3 so as this one p square q square then here if you come on 9 it becomes r minus 3 and here this one 63 then p into q and then again r minus 3 so here r minus 3 r minus 3 cancel out Here nine sevens are sixty three seven seven cancel out p cancel out with p square it becomes only one p q cancel out q square that is equal to only one q so here your final answer p into q or p q now next one sum number two in sum number two one divide as directed so here six into two x plus seven then into five x minus three divided by 3 into 5x minus 3 okay so now here you can write down this one in the fraction form so here 2x plus 7 then here 5x minus 3 divided by 3 into 5x minus 3 so it's cancel out 3 cancel out 6 it's 2 so here your answer 2 into 2x plus 7 or you can write down 4x plus 14 as your answer Next one, sum number two two. In sum number two two, here thirty three p q. Then multiply with p plus three, and again two q minus five. You can write down directly here in denominator eleven q here two q minus five. So two q minus five cancel out. Eleven three is a thirty three q q cancel out. So here your answer three p into p plus three. Now next one, sum number three. Here in sum number three one, factorize the expression and divide them as directed. So here the first one, here seven x cube minus sixty three x, then divided by seven into x minus three. So here you can write down in fraction form seven x cube minus sixty three x by seven into x minus three. So here seven x common. So it becomes x square minus nine, and that one here seven into x minus three. So seven seven cancel out. Here you can write down x. Now in the place of x square minus nine, x square minus nine means three square. So here you can apply the formula a plus b. That means x plus three into a minus b divided by x minus three. So here your final answer x into x plus three. Okay, now sum number three two. In sum number three two, the first one will be the numerator. So three p square, seventeen p plus ten, and second one will be the denominator. It's p plus five. So here you can apply the middle term factorization method as you have three and ten. So three into ten it becomes thirty. So factorize thirty, then two fifteen. As here seventeen. So you can write down three p square in the place of seventeen, fifteen p plus two p it becomes seventeen, then plus ten divided by p plus five. So here, if three p common, it becomes p plus three. Here, if two common, it becomes p plus three. Sorry, p plus five. And here, denominator also p plus five. So here, your numerator write down p plus five, and then three p plus two. Divided by p plus five, so p plus five cancel out. So here your answer three p plus two. 
Now next sum number three. In sum number three, you have ten xy. Then here fourteen y square plus forty three y minus twenty one. Okay, divided by five x. Then here seven y minus three. So for the first one, as here ten xy, write down this one. As here fourteen. Okay, then here forty three and then twenty one. So factorize fourteen two and seven, and here twenty one three and seven. So now we have to make here forty three. So seven seven is a forty nine. Forty nine minus six it forty three. So fourteen here y square. Then here forty nine this one y. Then here minus six y minus twenty one, and divided by five x seven y minus three. So as ten xy. Now here, if you common seven y, it becomes here two y, then plus seven. If you common three here, then two y plus seven. Here in denominator five x, then seven y minus three. Five cancel out, it becomes two x x cancel out. Okay, so that one equal to you can write down two y here seven y minus three, and then two y plus seven. Divided by seven y minus three, so it's cancel out here. Your answer two y then two y plus seven. Okay, now the last one. So guys, if you like my video, please please share this video and please subscribe my channel. So here twelve p q r then six p square minus thirteen p q plus six q square. Okay, divided by 6 pq, then here 2p minus 3q. So here you can write down this one 12 pqr. Now as here 6 p square, so 6 into 6 it becomes 36. 36 means 2 divide is 18. Then here 9 and then 3 3. Here the middle term is 13. So 3 into 3 is 9 and 2 into 2 4. So 9 plus 4. That one equal to here 13. So in the place of 13 pq, write down 4. Sorry, 9 pq minus 4 pq. Then here plus 6 q square divided by 6 pq. Then here 2 p minus 3 q. So 6 cancel out becomes 2 pq pq. Now here 2 r. Then here if uh, 6 p square. So suppose here uh, 3, 3 p common. So 2 p minus 3 q. And here it's uh, 2 q common. Then 2p minus 3q, okay, divided by 2p minus 3q. So that means here 2r, then here 3p minus 2q, multiply with 2p minus 3q, and again divided by 2p minus 3q. It cancel out. So your final answer 2r into 3p minus 2q.